And I asked her one day, why, why does it feel, why does Linda Moonbell feel like the place for you? And she said, because they know how to teach my brain. Brooklyn is um, just this light, just this person that um, is so kind and so empathetic and so challenging. But, um, she's incredibly bright. She's a sponge that just gathers information from all the areas that feel comfortable to her. I knew that she was struggling. I knew that she was um, having trouble finding focus. She just was really spending a lot more time on her own. The way that the academics were presented at her other school were just, they just were not resonating with her at all and I didn't really know why. It must have been a really frustrating year for her, especially her last year, because she wasn't able to keep up with her peers. And so I have a friend actually who's a behaviorist and I asked him to sit in on her class and he did. And he is the one that asked me if I had ever heard of Lindy Bell and I said I had not. And so he recommended that I bring Brooklyn simply just for the testing. And that was really my plan was to bring her to have her tested so that I could figure out what school to send her to in the fall. When we first met Brooklyn, this was a little girl, very, very bright, and she was significantly struggling with her reading. In fact, she avoided anything and everything having to do not only with reading, but even learning letters, and that even transitioned over into learning numbers as well. She really was considered illiterate. When we assessed her sight words, um, she had a score of five out of up to 200 words that she could have read, and that put her below the first percentile and below the first grade level. Again, a distinct area of concern. While we offer both online and in-person instruction, they chose the in-person option for the Linda Mood Bell Academy. I would say that the biggest difference for Brooklyn being able to be a Linda Mood Bell Academy student versus a more traditional program is that she gets one-on-one -on -one attention. I was concerned about what the content might be in the, in the Academy program. They're expanding so much on uh, with the history and with the science. They're able to make it all so interesting and exciting for her. And now she's worked through second grade work and is doing now third grade work and keeping up with what that curriculum would be. So after doing some instruction in Seeing Stars, we reassessed Brooklyn. And what we found is her word attack went from the second to the 68th percentile, or essentially from the skills of a first grader to approximately a fifth grade equivalency, which is remarkable. When we reassessed her sight words, she went from knowing five words to 76 words. This is her first year here doing the Academy at Linda Mood Bell. Even this many more months in now, six months in to Academy, she wakes up in the middle of the night to read. She reads full chapter books now by herself. And so now she's just growing so tremendously because she reads all about the earth and volcanoes and science and animals and the facts that she, the knowledge that she's can gain because she can read. I wish that every child that I know, that Brooklyn knows, could come here. There are, I have so many friends who, when I talk with them about Brooke's experience at Linda Mood Bell, I say, oh gosh, I, you know, that sounds like my child. That's what my child needs. I didn't want to um, change who she was. I just really needed to find a program that would support her.